Shalom to Mayor Deutsch, CEO of Regavim. Shalom, Yoni. You attended a debate in the Knesset on what many refer to as the electricity law. Tell us about the discussion that was held. So today we, were, we just uh, uh, came out of the committee discussing the law that would make it impossible, would, would make it possible to connect illegal structures to the electricity. As of today, the law in Israel says illegal structures cannot be connected to the main electricity line of uh, uh, of the uh, uh, electricity infrastructure. The law, the original law, which is a bad law, says that illegal structures that were built until 2018 will now be able to be connected to the electricity infrastructure. Today, what happened was uh, the, Walid Taha, the, the chairman of the committee, brought a different uh, uh, legislation, a bit similar to the original one, which makes the things even worse. It makes it possible to connect structures that were built even after 2018. It makes it possible to connect illegal structures that the courts gave demolition orders to these structures. And now the state of Israel, not only is it not enforcing the demolition, but it, it's, it's making it possible to connect these illegal structures to the electricity line, which, is, which is, makes this, this whole scenario much worse than the original law. Um, we heard that Ayala Chaket is now against these changes. We need to see whether or not she actually follows through and makes sure that the original law is the one that is being passed and not the one that was brought today to the committee. And many ask today, will this electricity law be implemented in the Jewish non-official settlements? As of today, this law will not be implemented in Judea and Samaria for no good reason. There's no reason why illegal structures that were built by Arabs will be connected to electricity, while Jews that built illegally will not be able to connect to electricity. I hope that will be changed in the, in the final uh, legislation that will be brought to the committee. Mary Deutsch, CEO of Regavim, thank you very much. Thank you, Yoni.